movie fans are gobbling up tickets to see Godzilla for many reasons. It has a lot of special effects. It has a lot of action and stuff in it. We're on vacation from New York, and it's way cheaper to see it here than back home. And New York is going to go away. New York is going to go away? Yes. And you like that idea? Yeah. Okay, so he's no New York fan. But Godzilla certainly is. In fact, the humongous monster actually lays its eggs in where else but Madison Square Garden. This $120 million action film is all about special effects. And they're so cool. Imagine the Jurassic Park dinosaurs on steroids roaming New York City. Sir, I think your story just walked by the window. The storyline is interesting enough. After a botched nuclear experiment by the French government, a radical reptile rises from the sea. He's Godzilla, and he's pregnant. Yes, you heard me right. Matthew Broderick is a scientist hot in his tail. The French CIA is out to clean up their mess, while a young reporter wannabe and a photographer do their best to gobble up a scoop. <laughs> Movie fans who watched the first showing give Godzilla big praises. Think? Oh, it was great. Yeah. We enjoyed every bit of it. I was scared a little bit. As for my humble opinion, Godzilla is a movie meant for the younger set, but those who love great special effects and real campy comedy should find it monstrously entertaining, if not a bit too long. On my unscientific scale of one to four bags of popcorn, Godzilla devours three bags. <laughs>